This is what I would do if I was American to make America great again. Listen, hear me out. It's important because sometimes you need somebody outside of a country to tell you who you actually are. What's actually happening in the United States is crazy. You know, it's crazy liberals and chop your dick off and like transgender, hundred genders, uh, satans and all those stuff, illegal immigrants and drug and murder and rape and all those stuff. I know the, all of these because I watch Infowar from Alex Jones. I know that. And I'm following that, the chaos, the whole world is in chaos, but what's actually happening in the United States is crazy, right? But a lot of people do not understand what they are actually trying to do. Yes, they're crazy. Yes, liberals are crazy. But the real purpose that they're doing is divide America into many pieces that they can break you all one by one. Do you understand? Because you know what United States great is that it's united. All of all those different people, people from different background, united, being proud Americans and fight together against the obstacle. That's what America great was great in the past. Look at now. At first, they have divided American people into black and white. All black is like like that was the, the blacks life massa. Black and white divided. Black people hates white people. White people hates black people. Now, now after that, it was LGBTQ. The people who supports LGBTQ, the one who doesn't support LGBTQ, divided into two: Israel, Palestine, Russia, Ukraine, uh, COVID vaccine, anti-vaccine. Um. You know, this is how they divide people into many pieces. One arrow, it's very easy to break. But if it's two, a little bit difficult. Three, four, five, if there's 10 arrows together, it's you cannot break it. That's why United States has to be united to be a great country. Make America great again. In my opinion, Japanese opinion is that it's not about come back to the traditional value and you know eliminate all those crazy people no to make your country great you have to be understanding the importance of united i know the left is crazy but it does not mean that right and left should fight each other because when two side american people same american people fight who benefit the one who is trying to make america into many pieces to divide people divide people into many pieces, get a, get a benefit. The best things you can do, I know the conservative are the normal people, the good people who has common sense, right? But it's not about because you're right, that's why let's insult liberals, let's blame, let's curse liberals. That's not what you can do. The best things you can do is love liberals because even though they think different, it's because of the education. You guys are the same American people. Why would you hate your own American people who is supposed to be united and fight against evils? Why is that? What you can do is you have common sense, man and woman, traditional values, men work and women support the man and help each other because men and women need each other. Traditional values and prove them that traditional values and normal common sense what actually works and make people happy and liberals also are realizing that crazy ideology of liberals are, are wrong the, the crazy feminism at the, at the age of 38 they're realizing that oh shit I thought I can be a boss bitch but it's not working at this age of 38, 40, I have no children, no husband, no family, a little bit of money in a career which not makes them happy. That's why a lot of people on the internet talking about I was wrong, even liberals. This shows that a lot of people are starting to realize I was wrong. They're understanding, they're accepting the conservative opinions, conservative values. If, if, if you just keep continuing insulting and blaming and hating liberals, 
when the liberals start to understand that they were wrong, they cannot flip their opinion to your conservative values. But if you only demonstrate, demonstrate them the right way and open the door for them, I'm not gonna offend you, do whatever you want, but you're gonna have consequence with your crazy ideology. But once you know the truth, you can come back to our normal common sense conservative values and teach you, accept you as a American because right, right or left, both people have one thing that is in common, that you guys love your country and wanna make your country safe place, peace place. When you, have the, when you set one thing, one common goal, then you can have discuss about it. Even though you guys have different opinions, I know there's huge discussion about Israel and Palestine. I'm not gonna talk about who is right and wrong, but I understand if your country is failing, going to the crazy way, don't you think your country's problem is more important than Israel-Palestine problem? It's important to, find, to talk about human, uh, human rights and stuff. It's very kind of you. But because of the problem outside of the United States, you want to fight each other with American, 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 destroy your country even more. Is that what you want to do? No. Discuss if it's right or wrong, what to do. But you too, liberalism, liberal and conservative, supposed to have one thing in common that you guys love your country and love your family, want to make your country great, safe, peace. If you understand that, kill each other, fight each other against liberal and conservative is wrong. If you just keep try to fight against each other that's what elite wants you to do don't you understand that's why they are bringing up this conversation of civil war south and north you think it's cool just there's crazy liberals that are out there let's 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 kill them and make my country great sounds cool maybe because yeah i understand you know american people has gotten stuff but the best way is that whether north or uh, north or south unite together and fight fight together against evil people that's the right way this way you don't need to kill your own people i'm pretty sure you don't want to ha get into the civil war i don't want to see that love love is the most important things even though the other side went crazy because of the crazy media crazy ideology show love tell them if they're way too crazy just ignore them demonstrate the right way one day they will realize because every mindset action has its consequence love love that's what jesus christ was teaching and especially the united states is a christian country Peace, together, united. This is the only way to make America great again. I think that's what Donald Trump is trying to do and Donald Trump will stop World War III, which we will, know, we will never wanna see. This is what I would do. This is what I would think if I was American to make America great again. What do you think about it? What's your point about this? Tell me in a comment and please if you like my video please donate me to create more contents like this i have no job donation link in the descriptions thank you so much see you in the next video stay positive guys maga